Good evening everybody and welcome to me talking in front of a camera again and I'm in my bedroom today with me me PlayStation and me Mega Drive and my latest treat for this little baby I was I wanted one of these this is a CM14 Amstrad monitor with built-in speakers it came with the 6128 Plus and the 464 Plus, but of course it is compatible for the GX4000 because I wanted something dedicated for the GX4000 to play. And this GX4000, like I've said before in my previous videos, is my third one and it has developed an output fault to televisions. So it's got a perfect, clear, absolutely mint um, output to the monitor, which I'm chuffed with. And listen to this. Hang on. Oh, see, I'm pressing the wrong button to control now. That's the dinner. Well, okay, well, you know what I mean. The built-in the built is great. Oh, look, I've screwed the monitor up now. Well, there you go. We'll turn it off. <laughs> but anyway, it does work perfectly when I'm not messing around with it. That's me. User error, as they call it. I've been wanting that for, for a while. So I'm chuffed with that. So thank you very much to the fellow on the south coast I bought that for. For a steel, £23. And speaking of steels, it's been an interesting month of um, pickups. All mostly PlayStation. I missed, like I've said, I missed out on a GX4000 game, and there, but there is another one that's flown around eBay at the moment, but I've got to check out. Um, but it's sort of like been the 99p month. Um, bargains everywhere, 99p. It started out, actually, I'll just pull out my. I started out with me finding a game. Sorry, I'm down here. It started out with me finding this game, Time Crisis. Now I thought I'd sold this game. I thought I'd lost it. Um, I thought I'd, I hadn't got it anymore. Um, so due to my exodus of shit, I sold my light gun. <sighs> Stupid thing to do. So I thought I'm going to get another light gun. Uh, sod it. So I'm going to get another light gun. And this one is boxed and in great condition, barely used. It's even got the uh, the PlayStation connector in it. I've got three of them now. But the fact that it's boxed and I got it for a tenner, nine ninety nine, brilliant. Works like a dream. I always I always like the G-Con forty five because this was the same gun that was on the arcade uh, of Time Crisis and. Uh, point Blank, which is one of my favourite sh uh, rail shooters, or light gun shooters. So, always like the design of this game. Works a treat. Works a dream with this uh, CRT. Works a treat with all them games. And then I sort of like got the light gun bug. And it's a flick of switching insanity went off in my head. So on my travels, for some reason, I just homed in on light gun games. Well, it's seen. So, what we managed to find, well, all for the PlayStation 2, I managed to pick up Time Crisis 2 for, again, 99 pence. Bargain. It says 29.99 on there. That was the original price. I paid 99p for that. Perfect condition. bit of a smudge on it but it plays no worries so happy with that and then lo and behold on my travels let's pop that down there um number three shows up time crisis three so you know all i need is the other one what's the other one called priority crisis something like that um but you know <laughs> Oh, the three time crisis is in one sort of soup. Again, 99p for this little baby. Haven't uh, trusted this one out yet. It's got a few smudges, marks, no scratches. So it should play fine when I get the, uh, the when I dust off the PS2. Because the PS1 and the Mega Drive and the GX5 have been getting a lot of use in here anyway. So time crisis three. But 99p not to be sniffed at. And again, still the 99p theme, I spotted this. Now I remember this in, 
Oh, Fairground Arcade's the first time I played this. Not using the G-Con, because it's Sega, but Virtual Cop. Elite Edition, if you will. I have no idea what that means in the real world, but I do know what Virtual Cop was. Um, so, I can't wait to give this a go and relive some of my old days. Oh, it's a purple disc, as you can see. But again, boxed, instructions, great condition, 99p, if you will. It's almost like these were sitting in a power land. Couldn't believe the prices of some of these. Really couldn't. Let me just have a sip. Out of shot. That was a terrible, terrible thing to do out of shot, wasn't it? Um, so, <laughs> what else did I get? All right, yeah. Again, this is something that I've been interested in this game for a while. I never played it, but I was interested in it. And my, and my daughter has fallen in love with this character whilst watching Sonic on All-Stars Racing. So... I picked up Shadow the Hedgehog on PS2. Again, 99p. Um, you know, sketchy reports about this game. But I will reserve judgment and I will play it and I will uh, maybe hate it, maybe enjoy it. I don't know. We'll have a go, have a look and uh, see if it's any good. I'm, I'm quite excited to play it. It's obviously put in a queue. Again, Great condition. Boxed. Instructions. 99p. We are in the 99p club. And we continue on in the 99p club. Oh, not that one. Um, with Virtual Tennis. Yeah, well, sports games. Bit of a throwaway. Yeah. I like my tennis games. Haven't run this yet, though, so I am wary. And it does contain a fair few scratches on this disc. So it might be a might be a snide, might be a dodgy, might be a pup. But you know, 99p, whatever. Box instructions. If it plays, fantastic. If it doesn't, well, I'll just I don't know, serve it somewhere. Who knows? <sighs> what was that? Ah, yes. And a couple of PlayStation ones. So I've got my PlayStation working. So I picked up a couple of Playstations, and I was flipping funny, happy, happy, happy to find this. The first Wipeout. Oh yes, very happy. 99p. Yes, it's platinum, but look, look, how much instructions do you need? Eh? This F, um, F6, is it F, F, F3600 Racing? Must be very complicated to have a rule book that thick. And very PC for all the languages. But anyway, back to the real world. Great condition, works beautiful, B U A beautiful to steal Jim Carrey's catchphrase. 99p. I even offered the charity shop more money for this. Because it's, I think it's, it's worth more than 99p. Well, uh, an absolutely fantastic game. And then, to top that off, in the next shop, okay, it was a pound more, but Wipeout Fusion, another Wipeout. So I'm nearly, I'm doing well on building my Wipeout collection back up again. Now I've got four. No instructions, unfortunately. Gutty. But, disc is clean. Now again, haven't run it yet, but hope it does bit shitty about the instructions missing but you know you can't have everything in life 199 if the game works then it'll be good if it does uh, we'll see most of the games do work I've already tested them but some of them got meant to do it and the last thing I picked up which is I'm not a fan of this game but I thought I'd have it just to give it a whirl but I was more of a fan of the original 2D's uh, which is um, the uh, Street Fighter, EX Plus A, EX Plus A, what does that even mean? I mean, Street Fighter 3D, that's what I should have called it. But anyway, Street Fighter EX Plus A, plus Alpha Sigma Delta, the alphabet, anyway, it doesn't matter. 99p again though, so again, you know, shot in the dark. Good condition, not, not a mark on it. Yeah, 
another one for the uh, the pile, the PlayStation pile. So very happy with that lot. Um, I was most happy with this. I'm going to give it a clean up, uh, and the fact that I've got my GX working on it is I'm just absolutely chuffed about that because I don't have to get my mint condition one out of its box. Sad. Yes, I know. Hey, that's what we collectors are, aren't we? So, um, that's what I've been uh, picking up over these uh, last couple of days. Prob oh, I've got this as well. I don't know why I picked this up. Uh, it was just lying around. Is it a four disc case? I've got some loose discs somewhere. I've definitely got Soul Blade, Tekken 2, a couple of others lying around somewhere. I've got to find out. I think they're in my, uh, uh, my um, uh, boot cupboard that I've got downstairs. Boot cupboard? Boot box. You don't know what that is, but I know what it is. I think they're in there, and I can then I can just rescue them and, and put them back in there. Um, anyway, I'll stop rambling now. Uh, me cold still here, just about, uh, but it's nearly gone. So I'll have a sip. Mm -mm. And I will uh, bid you farewell. No bug.